Hey guys, back here with another video. Today we actually have something new that we have done on the channel. Today we're gonna to be trying out a beard growing kit. Uh, listen, listen, I know, I know, I haven't done anything like this before on my channel, but I said, you know what, I'm gonna try something new. And this is something that I'm doing personally in my own life. That I thought, you know what, I'd rather share it, I wanna document it, see what happens to it. I don't want y'all to be on that journey. Basically today we will be Starting our journey basically with this beard grown kit that I bought. It is, is by Verolin Professional Beard Growth Kit. Um, this is the first time I've ever tried a beard grown kit. I've always heard about them, of those, you know, those needle things, rollers that you, you know, put on your, the side of your face and apparently you just grow a beard. I don't know if it works for everybody, but we're gonna check it out. I did some research about it. So, um, anyways, we're just gonna hop right into it. Now, I did get this kit a couple weeks back but i didn't get a chance to retry it so you, you can see a little dents in it because i did kind of like you know squish it up a little bit and i kind of put it somewhere so there's a couple dents in it so basically we're going to open this up and see what we find from it or find inside of it um it is from what the script from what the script description said it is a full kit and come with all sorts of stuff in it let's see what the back says the back says it will come with beard oil beard palm beard roller and a storage bag um, and the roller is uh, hmm, 0 0.25 millimeter, opening the pores, stim stimulating or stimulates the absorption of active ingredients and beard growth. And then for the beard growth oil, it moisturizes and promotes the growth of beards, more stylish and refreshes. So um, let's see, let's open it up. All right, so we're gonna open this up. Ooh, I don't wanna shake it. Yeah. All right, so. Uh, nothing. So the box looks like it came in good condition. There's a couple of dents here and there, but that, that's probably my fault for like crunching it up and putting it, you know, away somewhere in the bathroom. Um, but anyways, this is the, the a thank you, I guess, note from the people. Um, let me read a little bit of description about the company. So with Valoran, a clean, tidy, and healthy beard can make you look more confident and stylish. So we hope you are pleased with our product and services. If any questions, please, you know, contact them at the email da, 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 da. it says and it gives us basically i guess a one to six step plan on how to take care of your beard and then a warning at the end that basically i guess gives warning to skin infection um fungal skin active acne all types of things of that nature as well so from right here you can see the note card i was just talking about so put that to the side we got the beard growth oil here uh, it is um, softening in with the arrogant oil. I know that's a good oil. Well, I've heard a lot of people say that's a good oil. It's the beard palm. And then we have a kit. I'm guessing this is the manual instructions, okay? We got a comb. And we have the, the roller, the beard roller as well. Let me see how the comb is really cute. The comb has a, the brand on it as well. We have the bag, the storage bag. That's it, I think that's all that's in there basically. So I'm gonna put the storage bag in there, back in there. So let's open this thing up. They got plastic in my mouth. Here's the oil. So yeah guys we've basically taken everything out of the the kit itself i guess i, I probably will keep this this um 
this box so I can keep everything in there. Um, I guess the bag, the storage bag, of course, would just be used for when you're traveling, just like if you use a regular like um, toiletry bag for anything. But we do have everything. We have the oil, we have the beer roller, we have the the the, 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 the bomb, the bomb, bomb, beard bomb. I don't know how you pronounce it. There and we have the instructions. So we're gonna look at the manual and see what steps we're gonna do. And today we're gonna do our first day and just take a look at it. All right, so we're opening the manual now. And I thought it was gonna be some short little thing, but they kind of have everything spread out. So it's a lot more than I thought it would be. They do have directions for the oil on here, for the for the beard palm on here, for the roller. And then they got a warranty thing on it as well. Um, on the back, same thing. I guess they just have it on both sides. So if you're wondering, it's, it's gonna be the same thing. You see all those, all in English. I thought they was gonna have one side Spanish, one side English, but everything like, I don't get why there's both sides. If one's gonna be English, one's not gonna be English. I don't know. But we're gonna check this out and then I'll show you guys the process while we're doing it. All right, so we have finished reading the, all the instructions. And today it looks like the only things we'll probably be doing are the beard roller with the needles and then the beard oil um, because the beard palm or beard balm, that's more like, I would say for when the beard is a little thicker because it's supposed to be used as a conditioner or as, you know, a styler. And right now I don't really have anything on the side. So speaking of that, I will show you guys right now, like what I look like right now. Um, and then I'll show y'all, of course, progression over time of how the beard is looking. But first we're gonna use the beard roller. And to do that first, we do have to clean our face. It says thoroughly to make sure there's any gunk or anything there, you know, lying on the face and the skin before we can start using the roller. After that, we'll start using the roller and then I'm guessing the oil afterwards. So let's hop into it. Ah, ah, my eye. I got something my eye. Hello. Oh, I got soap in my eye. That was a terrible idea. Oh, wow. Oh. Good discretion. Oh. <laughs> so now, for the, for the oil, it did say after a hot shower, which I'm not really taking at the moment. I, I'm not, I mean, I don't even really take a shower at the moment. I'm just doing this off of like warm water. Now you don't have to be having scorching hot water for the video or for the for the whole you know process of this, but I would just use warm water just to wash your face, clean off germs, bacteria, all those other things, the crevices, all the in and outs and everything, even if you're just doing this section right here. Um, but anyways, we're gonna start with the beard roller. So for this part, it just says we're supposed to, like I said before, we clean off the beard roller before um, of course kind of just rotate it while it's in the sink that's what i'm doing it's still wet now and i'm gonna kinda just shake it off you kind of use a paper towel to dry it off a little bit but really just shake it off i guess and so now we are close to it says horizontally diagonally and vertically just roll it a couple times in the area where you want I guess to grow. It does say you can use this to fix patches in your beard or if you're, or if you're just trying to grow a beard like, like basically I'm doing right now. You just kind of put it in everywhere where you want it to connect and grow. The ingrown hairs are not really coming out. Maybe that area here, can you see? It says about five to eight times, I mean, I don't think I'm doing too bad right now. I'm just kind of rolling it back and forth and moving with it and seeing how it goes. I do have a kind of a goatee going on here, but I mean, it took a while to go. And this middle part right here is kind of, it's like a patch, it's not really growing here, but the rest of it's kind of, you know, on the longer end. So I'm kind of hoping that if I do grow a beard that it comes in here and through here, and then of course it connects here as well. And up here, I kind of do have a mustache going on. I've, I haven't cut this for like years. So I don't know what's going on with it exactly. Um, I guess I could also really, it does say you can also do mustache. So 
it does what it works with whatever facial hair you got going on. Hopefully y'all can see it. I, I barely got it, but the last couple months it's been growing in a little bit more. And I can feel the needles, it doesn't hurt. It does say lightly do it, gently, do it gently so you don't hurt yourself. And of course, after you're done using it, cause I think I did roll it up enough. You gotta clean it off, of course. You know, make sure you get off all the skin or any, you know, dead cells that could be caught up on the roller while you're cleaning it. You just put it back in its little container and call it a day, I guess. We're gonna apply some of the oil. So it did say just two, it said two to three drops. You can put on your your palm and just kind of boom, boom. Okay, so I put three. I put three drops because I'm I'm still a little little beginner with this. So it says just generously put it throughout your hands and kind of just apply it on both sides. It's definitely light, it's a very light oil. It's not anything too heavy, so. I'm gonna put it everywhere where I put the roller. I don't know if you want to put the oil first and then roll it, or, or roll it first and then put the oil, but I'm doing it roll it first and then put the oil because I know with the needle, it's like opening it up. And so now that I'm putting the oil, I'm putting the oil in the hole, if that makes sense. If that makes sense, y'all let me know, but that's the way I'm doing it. And I guess you could also use it on your eyebrows too. I don't know if this is like a separate thing. If I'm doing this wrong, please somebody let me know. But this is what I know so far. And I'm not doing it too rough either. I'm doing it very gently. Making sure I don't press it too hard. And they do have the comb as well. I forgot to show you guys the comb. But this is the comb. Um, I really don't have that much hair to really comb in the first place. I do have the little goatee, but... It's not, it, it just kind of makes it look more full. So I guess it's more for when you do have the beard. I have nothing here. So I'm not gonna comb it on my skin because I don't have anything there to really comb. So I don't damage my skin as well in the process. But anyways guys, that was the Vera Rollin Roller or Vera Lynn Professional Beard Rolling Kit, Growing Kit. So if you guys do want to check that out, I'll put a link in the description below for the website and for where I got it off of Amazon. But if you guys did enjoy the video, make sure you leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more videos like this. Um, I would keep you guys updated on the journey and let you know how everything's going. I might even do a skincare routine as well because I do need a little bit more help with my skincare. Maybe I'll have my girlfriend do it with y'all. Um, anyways, until next time, peace.